What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Plants vs. Zombies 2 and this week during Pyrevine Searing Season is the Jack-O-Lantern Tournament and we're going to showcase that today. But hey look, they're finally advertising Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville within Plants vs. Zombies 2. Super cool, you can get that hat if you log in uh, from now to November 1st, so I recommend that. Uh, also in store, uh, you can get some Lawn of Doom level up. My Jack-O-Lantern isn't very high level, so like if we wanted to go to the store and level some of the Lawn of Doom plants up, we could do that we could go it's 10 gems and basically what happens if you spend those 10 gems you get uh you know like what five and five or something like that we got five ghost pepper five puff shroom i mean yeah and that would keep going like, like if you did another 10 it would be something like uh what do we got we got five jack-o-lantern so i'm at 305 of 400 and then uh five ghost pepper so Again, I wish they would sell these in bigger one, like a hundred, like a hundred gem. Come on, get a, get one hundred Lana Doom seed packets for hundred gems. That way, you won't have to click as much. But uh, anyway, just my view. Let's go into. Uh, we'll do the pinata party by the end of. The, well, I might forget. Let's do the pinata party right now. I might forget if I don't do it now. But then we'll go into the arena, see where we are. I imagine I stayed in the same spot. So uh, let's continue onwards. Here we go. Let's play it as we see it. Let's put down some stuff here. Alright, going down here. And uh, yeah, Witch Hazel can come turn these guys into some, uh, some puff shrooms. Go faster, please, Witch Hazel. Okay, you know, not too bad. Actually, having the plant food is probably pretty good. There we go. Now they're all fume shrooms or puff shrooms. What are they called? Fume shrooms. <laughs> That's okay. I don't have to remember things and what they're called. This is going to be an easy one, I imagine. I'm going to put down a third. There you go. Look at all this. Look at all this. They're going to get hit. Now that wizard does bother me, but hopefully we can. Oh, the wizard got got. Good deal. Now hold on. There's a whole bunch here. Hold up. Things are getting crazy. We got four. Is that enough? Let's find out. Let's find out. Four seems to be doing pretty good. All right. Okay, there we go. Now we have five, by the way, for those of you who can't count. <laughs> okay. We're getting them done. We're getting them done. This is good. Let's put, in, put another one down. So many shrooms around. We did it. We did it. That was easy. Creepy music. Let's do Jack Lantern, Witch Hazel, and coins. There we go. Not that we get a choice. All right. Very cool. So, uh, what we are going to do now is uh, the check out Arena and see what Arena is all about this week. I'll also take a peek into the epic quests just to see. Well, first up, we got stuff completed, but we'll also just kind of see what else is here. Uh, just out of curiosity for you guys this week. In case you want to drop in and do any of them. So, uh, yeah, we still got the epic quest for Pyrevine. We're just kind of shows you how to use the Pyrevine a little bit more. We only get coins at the end. We have a uh, premium seeds for Jack o Lantern. Might be good to do uh, since I don't quite have my Jack o Lantern maxed out. Uh, the far future again, you can go in and do that. You can refrigerate zombies and try to level up Peppermint for free. Let's see what the arena has in store for us today. And then uh, maybe we'll do a few rounds. I okay got 10 mints for you know placing ninth and so let's figure it out let's see what we got this week uh fire oh man electricity has been nerfed but fire has been buffed and uh we are pretty close to oh well, no we're 50 away let's go in let's see what we got let's see what we got this week let's see what it's all about bam, 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 ba -da -dum. all right that was a scary sound. All right, so up front, so we, unfortunately electricity's been nerfed. We have a Frankenstein monster. We have these guys who are frozen. They're jack-o'-lanterns there. Uh, so it's kind of cool that we start with jack-o'-lanterns and we're required to use jack-o'-lanterns. Uh, we can't use Blover or explosives, it seems. Can I not use, can I use, uh, let's see. Can I use primal potato mines? Oh, I can. Okay, so some explosives. But I can use potato mines. But they can't go up over there. Ah, that's not going to be a good thing. Uh, you know, laser bean. Ooh, is that electricity? No. It's piercing. Piercing might work. 
those things are frozen. Fire has been elevated. We're gonna, we're gonna need sun as well. Huh. I'm just trying to think what's gonna be good here. I don't know. Well, let's try a uh, heavily fire-based strategy, maybe. I'm trying to think here. What could be good? Okay, so maybe... Sorry, I don't really know. Um, <laughs> uh, we'll bring in that. Let's bring in more fire. You know, we could bring in fire pea shooter. We could bring in uh, the pepper pult. But I have a feeling this is going to be kind of crazy. Maybe I'll bring in tile turnip. And maybe then I'll bring in... Uh, this guy, and then where's the fire pea shooter? There we go. Let's rock. Let's see what happens. I don't know. I don't know, man. I'm gonna need a lot of money probably for this strategy. All right, here we go. By money, I mean sun. All right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. I'm gonna basically go all out. All right. Get ready. All right, so now well, as soon as I can get a, uh... Huh, let's see. So here's the thing, I don't, I'm not very good at using these. I totally forget that you have to click them. Okay. So we haven't had any more uh, wind come through, have we? Try again. Uh, these things will eventually break. All right, good stuff. Okay, she's probably gonna eat that thing. The problem is I haven't gotten any plant food yet, so I thought I would have plant food way sooner than this. Put in the jack-o'-lantern again, holy cow. There we go, we got two of them. Let's unleash now, let's see what happens. There we go, look at that, look at that. That's, that's a big move, right? All right, we're, our score is worse than... <laughs> I should have brought in... Uh, I should have definitely brought in... Maybe I'll rapidly increase my score. I should have brought in something else, though. All right, like so. There we go. I mean, it's, I, I don't know. I'm going to hope to get lucky here, I guess. I don't know. Here we go, bring it to him. Huge wave of zombies is approaching. Here we go, I don't know man, I don't think I'm gonna beat him, but maybe. Darn, I can't believe it. I mean, I believe it, but darn, that was a close one. So he was actually using uh, potato mines. Could work. I'm not going to... I don't care to retain my streak there. So, yeah. That wasn't super great. I thought I was going to get plant food a little earlier. Uh, that was the main thing with that strategy. Let's go back in. we got a lot of work to do. To try to figure out the best strategies here. Now, everyone sticks kind of back. So, that's good. Uh, but... We'll, God, that's so scary. 
the sound is so loud at the beginning. Uh, man, yeah, electricity is buff. I mean, bruised. Um, you know what I could try? Let me just try call a power strategy. This could work, right? Now, I'm going to want to bring in something other than call a power, but call a power could work. And then bring in, uh, moonflower. Uh, honestly, probably bring in, um... We probably do still want... Hmm. Well, no, we want Pyre Vines so they don't... Oh, yeah, they don't freeze. Um... Maybe we're gonna want this... No, not this, sorry. But yeah, maybe, but no. Um... I want... Yeah, I think I want this. Maybe. No. No. I guess I just want... Man, I don't even know. I don't even know what I want. Um... Well, gosh, man, I really don't know. Let's bring in, um, this. Sure, enchantment. Whatever. I really don't know. So, what I like about this is that might work. Alright, let's rock. So they might, yeah. So we might be able to open that up pretty quickly. Okay. Wish me luck. Oh, I should have brought in. Mm, now I kind of regret it. That's okay. All right. I'm gonna put it there. Yeah, I don't have any any plant food. I'm trying to break these graves, right? Eventually, we're going to break through, probably. Uh-oh. Alright, we got him. Oh, there's something. Alright, maybe this is a better situation then. So we're only at 300,000. I wish those would like easily convert them over. It should keep these things kind of thawed out a little bit. So we're at 400,000. Yeah, we're at five. This is not a good enough strategy. Not a good enough strategy, but we did beat our opponent. Man, I'm struggling here. I'm trying to think about what we want to do. It may not be a bad idea to actually use the uh, explosives, but I mean, we still got to worry about the fact that there are the graves there. 
We could try a piercing strategy. We could also try a three-peter strategy with Torchwood. That could work. But I don't know. God, that scares me each and every time. So our score's like a million, basically, is where we're standing right now. If we bring in a three-peter... I might have to come back to this later this week and find out like if you guys have any ideas. But we can do appeasement with a three-peter and then we can bring in the torchwood. And then the torchwood, you know, we might want to bring in that, maybe. We can prepare for when we finally break one, just that all torchwoods get it, you know. Um, we could also... Oh, we also need money, don't we? We need, we need pyre vines. Darn it. Hmm. Well, let's bring in uh, this. Maybe we don't need... If we have jack-o'-lanterns... I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. Let's rock. This might totally mess me up, but let's rock. And then, uh, yeah, this is going to be a, a mess, but that's okay. Um, let's, uh, let's try to get a lot of this going. Here, let's, let's rock. This might be a good enough start, maybe. There we go. All right. Okay, nope, that's frozen. Let's put in Jack- Jack-o'-lantern is a heat source, right? Crap. Oh, here, you know what? I don't need you guys here. Get out, get out. That thing is still frozen, dude. Yikes. Yikes. That thing is still frozen. What the heck? Okay, that it takes a jack-o'-lantern forever to thaw these guys out. What the heck? Here, just put that there. Oh my god. This is this has gone bad, by the way. Because I wasn't doing what I needed to do, I guess. All right, here we go. We got something here. Darn it! Almost. Almost got them all. No, no, don't freeze him again. Don't freeze him again. We were doing great. Okay, but we're not doing super great. If we could break anything again, that'd be nice. Keep everything nice and toasty. We're only at 300,000. I'm doing absolute terrible. There we go. Does that help? <laughs> they just froze completely. Ugh, this is even worse than I thought, but... Whatever, man. So, yeah, that strategy was bogus. I really needed some pyre vines or something. This is tough. Okay. 
I won, but this is a tough strategy. This is a tough one to figure out. I'm gonna try laser beans though with pyre vines. Got a bunch of stuff. A lot of stuff. It's hard to know like what's not gonna freeze. I mean, I know what doesn't freeze, but it's hard to hard to predict what's gonna happen here. Apparently there's some sort of a thing where like if you let a mint freeze, then the mint effects just keep going forever. But I don't fully really understand how that works. Gosh, man, I can't bring in anything. All right, that strat was no good for me. Um, you know, I think laser beans, it, or it would be good to test them out just to see. We could bring in laser beans with, uh, maybe even Pokra. And you know, we could might even want to just try electricity because it's been bruised, but maybe not completely nerfed. So where laser beans at? I don't know how I always forget. Right there. And then let's bring in the pyre vine because we're going to need that in effect. Man. Okay. Wish me luck. <laughs> Yeah, okay. And so, like, as soon as possible, we want, we want them to, to break this stuff, don't we? All right, I got one pyre vine in before it was too late. There too. And yeah, we're trying to get everything defrosted here. For now, we can use the uh, the, the pumpkin things. All right, no, get out of here, please. Okay, yeah, this is tough. Oh jeez. This guy keeps keeps causing trouble here. Maybe now we're making some progress, I don't know. I'm only at half a million still. I'm trying to keep everything, you know, defrosted and whatnot. Yikes. Pyre vine there. I'm not doing terrible. Man, it's just so hard to keep everything defrosted by holding down puppy. I beat my, my score though overall. So this seems to be going pretty good. Here, this is gonna haunt some people, right? That's what this does. So yeah, 1.5 million is pretty good. Darn it, I just realized. Yeah, 1.5 million. Gosh. There's gonna have to be something different. I gotta do something different to like really ramp up the score. And it's just a matter of maybe finding an opponent who has an exceptional score to learn what he does, or she. So, 
So the ice is a big, big problem. Big, big problem for the ice. Um, if we go in... Just trying to imagine... Trying to... God! Every time. I'm just trying to imagine... Okay, you know what? What about an... What about, like, really lean into the fire? Like, really, really, really lean into the fire strategy here. And by that, I mean, like, just bringing all the fire plants, bringing the peppermint. Uh, where's the peppermint? Where's, where's, there it is. He's only level one. Um, but, but yeah, bring in, maybe I can level him up. But bring in the fire plants, bring the peppermint, bring in, like, everything. And that's all we'll use. And we'll also use, uh, yeah, this is fine. Where else? Where else are we at? Um. We do need, we do need money. Okay, come on, Zach. Where was it? <laughs> there it is. Uh, so peppermint. Let's bring in the. Uh... Are there any other fire plants that I should bring in? I can't bring in the jalapeno. Although I want to. Let's truly go for like an all fire based strategy. I want to bring in the pepper pulse. I just can't, I can never remember where things are. Pepper pulse. Dude, I don't know where the pepper pulse is. What's happened to me? There it is. Let's rock with this and see what's going to happen. So I'm thinking about putting these in the front. And then doing something crazy like that. That should have enough range. Actually, let me dig that up. That should be a good start. Let's rock with this. There you go, there you go. Should be a really decent start. And yeah, we'll just drop this in the back. We'll just wait. Don't eat that, don't eat that. Alright, good, good. None of this stuff is gonna freeze then, right? There you go. So far so good, so far so good. Here we go, here we go, get ready. We're gonna start putting down the mints like crazy. There we go, fire. So I know it's only a level one. There we go. So this all fire strategy seems to be working pretty darn good. Again, I know it's only level one, but that's okay. We'll figure it out. I mean, yeah, this is great. This is, uh, now that everything's in place, this is great. Alright. 
1.4 at least. 1.5, so a decent strategy, my best strategy yet. 1.6, 1.7, so, so far my best strategy yet, just going straight up flames and fire. And so, yeah, I'm really struggling to think of anything better. I am curious though about electricity. Like I know it's been nerfed, but I wonder how bad it is. And so I'm really considering just bringing it, bringing it in. And just seeing what we can do with electricity, wh whether or not it works, that's fine. I just got to know. So, let's do it. Gosh, okay. So let's do, uh, let's do, instead of that, and that, and that, we're gonna bring in the electric pea shooter. And the filament just to see what happens. And then if we want anything else, I don't even know. We can bring in, well, we brought in the, uh, let's, uh, let's imitate that. Let's imitate the pyre vine. Cause we might want some more, uh, yeah, let's rock with that. Here we go. Now, can I still load in my last time strategy? That's good. Okay, let's start slow. Let's rock. And then we're gonna get to put down a, uh... There you go. Now I know. Alright, we know. We know how this works. Alright. We are still doing damage despite it, so... Alright. Darn, what, he ate through- come on, how do you do that? How do you do that now? All right, stop him, he's a monster. I don't think we're gonna stop him this time, that's okay. Oh boy. All right, all right. We're not doing too bad right now, I guess. Everything seems protected enough. Two columns of the electric pea shooters. All right, more, uh, more flames over there, I suppose. More fire right there. Doesn't seem to be perfect, but we're doing something here. All right, here we go. We got electricity. So we only have 30 seconds left. We haven't even broke everything yet. That's okay. We finally now have a shot at this. I think we had more time, we'd be able to crank out a really nice score. We got a million. So, you know, they yeah, yes, electricity was nerfed. And no, it didn't get us our best score ever. But we got a decent score given the facts, especially since my my electric picture is mastered so well. It would probably do me good to upgrade my uh, peppermint. This wasabi whip have any sort of effect let's take a look 
If it has a defrost effect, that would be amazing. Uh, let's take it. Let's, first up, let's level up this thing. Why not? All right. Uh. All right. Hmm. I'm trying to think what I was going to do. I'm trying to think, like, okay. Um. I don't know. I'm still, okay, like. The poker did okay. If I'm thinking about close-up things, the poker did okay. Does this have... Okay, re okay, yeah, this does have the special. I'm going to try Wasabi Whip. Okay, this might actually change the game. Let's try a Wasabi Whip strategy. Maybe this will be my best score yet. I didn't think about it, though. But if I could do Wasabi Whip, this could be really awesome. Gosh, that noise. Okay, so... No to that, no to that. Maybe, maybe duplicate, I don't know. Wasabi Whip, though, on the other hand. It's only 75. Let's, uh, let's actually bring that in. Hold on, where's, where's, uh... Pyrevine again? There it is, sorry. Let's bring in Wasabi Whip. It's an armament. I'm gonna, I'm gonna imitate it. Because we might be able to just bring it in easy. And then, uh, where's the armament plant? Uh, there it is, sorry, that's only level one. Anyway, let's rock with that. If this does okay, then maybe I'll do a, a tile turn-up strategy with it. Sure. Uh, hold on. That's fine there. All right, let's rock. Here we go. This could be really interesting. So, let's bring him close. Now, this could be really insane. How'd that shrink him? Oh, the armament shrinks him. Wow. All right, that's looking pretty good. In fact, just keeping these back here might not be a bad thing either. I really should have considered bringing in the, uh, the tile turnip this time around. Because these things do get kind of close, maybe even too close. Having the tile turn up could have been amazing. Yeah, the fact that. Okay, that's a lot dead right there, but still. This ain't a bad score. All right. Yeah, I could have used something in the back. Like other than the other than these, I could use something in the back. gracious that's good I just might get a good enough score but I probably need to refine this like a lot I don't really know what else to do differently but there's got to be something else I can change here
1.2. I mean, like, the other score with the... Okay, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe if I would have used the mint more often. I don't know. Huh. You know, maybe something in the back would have helped. I don't know. Let's do one final round. If you guys have any ideas on, you know, what would be better than this. I mean, the all-fire strategy. God, that scares me. The all-fire strategy seems to be pretty good. But now I'm trying to think past it. I'm trying to think, like, well, what else can I do? You know, like, what else would be good? Exploder nut might work, right? Does Exploder nut... How do I view, okay. Do you think Explodo Nut does the trick too? Explodes when eaten. Do you think it radiates a heat? Oh man, we, 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 we should try it at least. Like Explodo Nuts could work. Uh, something in the back could work. We Pyre Vine, of course. Uh. Or you know, instead of pyre vines, let's just put in uh, let's just put in the the fire pea shooters, dude. I don't know. I was trying to think of some ideas here. Maybe even the bowling bulbs. I don't know. This could be good. And then I guess if I were to bring in a mint, it would continue to be the uh, the the ar the enforcement. So let's give this another go. This seems good. Pumpkins are there in case you want them. Let's rock. Here we go. I don't know if those are radiate heat or not. Those also shrink. I totally forgot about that. That's a good one. So now we're at a point where it feels like feels like we're going to do okay. And eventually I'm not going to need my uh, I'm probably not going to need my whips anymore. All right, there we go, that blew up. And then what do we do with, what do we do with these? I totally forget what to do with these. We could haunt the people, I guess. Yeah, we're just supposed to use them on the mints. That's what we do. We use it on the mints. I totally forgot. I was like, what do we do with this? There we go. Shrink them down. It should be. They should go easy then. I'm gonna spin the rest of these on the mints. 
We're at one million. This might be fine, ultimately. Okay, only 1.2. Yeah, 1.3, 1.4. So yeah, my all fire strategy seemed to be the best. Uh, you know, I, I I am winning though. I'm beating my opponents, so that's important. I did lose that one, and if I would have gotten 1.7 like I did with the all fire strategy, then I wouldn't have lost. So so far that's why I got. If you guys know of a strategy that breaks two million, let me know. Maybe I'm totally not thinking straight on this one, but let me know in the comments below. Tweet me some photos on Twitter. Thanks for your support. Come back next time for more. Uh, I'm number tied for first. Three-way tie for first. Uh, but I'll see you next time for more. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.